What up, Gemini? My lovely Gemini. My coworker is a Gemini. Oh, this is your summer 2020 reading. Hi, I'm Camila Rose with the Bliss Institute. It's so nice to see you. I'm here. Yes. Um, that was a, a Gemini way of starting things. Um, my coworker is a Gemini. She just had her birthday, so happy birthday to the Geminis. Your season just passed. And I hope you had a great time. I hope you were able to do something that you enjoyed. Here's your first card. Ooh, everybody is getting this card. This is Three of Pentacles. There is some reflection to be going on. There is some growth and building some multiplications but you have got to look at your contracts you've got to make sure that everything is on the up and up check that budget check it check the budgets make sure your accounts are where they're supposed to be um just keep up with things keep up with things i think this is a great time that we just want to make sure that our that what we think is happening with our money what we think is happening with our homes what we think is happening with our material world around this is actually what's happening eight of swore eight of wands fast energy is coming at you fast fast messages fast movement there's changes going on Woo! again that's why it's important to know what's happening with what you think is going on with your plans and with your goals and such because when things change quickly if you are working off of old information then you might not make the best decisions for you because you're not working with what's actually going on princess of cups get in touch with those emotions be creative go with the flow people want to be around you people find you to be enticing they find you to be interesting so they're ready to you know if these messages come in and you're ready to respond because they're opportunities oh people are like yes let's offer them to you let's see what you've got we like your flow we like your energy we reviewed what you've done we've seen your work and we would like to see you know we'd like to talk to you about it of course it could also be you know if you haven't been paying some bills it might be some messages coming to collect and you might be trying to charm your way out of it princess of pentacles you've got a lot of this energy going on princess of pentacles so taking a new approach there is a spark there's a spark of something creative going on a way for you to perhaps if you found some things you were not anticipating for you to make some more money for you to solve some of these issues or if you found that things were better off than you thought you can use this you can invest this you can turn it into something bigger and help it to grow we got the two of wands leading you to a choice do you stay where you are do you take a new trip do you take a new route do you explore the world beyond you you know the internet gives us access to pretty much anything so if there's an endeavor that you've always wanted to pursue and you felt like you couldn't because of you were confined or because of finances or something of that nature, then utilize the resources that are available to you in this world and see if it'll work. The sun card. Let yourself be seen. You are so brilliant, Gemini. You're so brilliant. You're so creative and such a light and a spark you know but sometimes you have to step outside of yourself and you have to allow other people to see you and to let you shine and let you um really just go forth in the world it's good energy for you for the summer gemini princess of wands you've pulled almost every princess card move move go go follow through have faith in yourself. Go after these endeavors. It's all backing you up. And it's, it's a big season of growth and a big season of change. And it's really new. It feels, everything feels really new. Six of Wands, success. You'll have find success. You'll find victory. People might have been maybe not believing that you were going to be able to, you know, achieve this or maybe you doubt it yourself but you'll find victory now we get to this queen of wands and i believe she was in reverse she flipped over in my hand but i believe she was in reverse so this is kind of giving me this could go either way energy so again 
I feel like we go back to this energy, your general energy, this three of pentacles energy. Just know what's happening. Create your own fortune. Create your own path. That way you can be always involved in what is happening. And it'll make sure that you'll be able to track and say something does go amiss. Something does go wrong. People, you had to get victory over something. People were maybe not doing what they were supposed to be doing. You can catch it quickly. Queen of Wands. Did I say Queen of Pentacles? It's Queen of Wands. A Queen of Wands is going to be someone who is, it is an energy that is aware. They are fiery. They are hot. But they have an understanding of how best to get what it is. And, you know, when you're wanting to bend metal you have to heat it up and you have to be very precise about this process because if you heat it up too much it'll bend and it'll get all warped and gross and it'll change and if you don't heat it up enough then it's going to be hard you're not going to be able to really move it and mold it the way you want to it's precision it is in it is a practice it is a task so you know just keep that in mind you're going to need to embody some of that energy and you have You've done it. All of the princesses are here. The Princess of Cups. The Princess of Wands. The Princess of Swords. And the Princess of Pentacles. You've got them all. You have got some wonderful, wonderful opportunities coming up for you. You've got some wonderful energy that's in every facet of your life. You can change and you can shift. You can grow. You will have expansion this summer. This summer is going to be really something for you. Maybe something that you're not used to encountering this level of, of desire for new, for more, for stepping outside of your comfort zone, for stepping outside of the box, for speaking up and making sure that you are heard, for finding ways to communicate that others are willing and open to hearing. So, whew, what an exciting summer for you. Gemini, I'm here for it. Okay, outcome card. Let's get an outcome card. Outcome. Outcome card. Such goodness. I'm interested in to find out what was going on with this Six of Wands, but it's probably just that whatever you set your mind to or whatever choice you made, perhaps you um, found that it served you well in the end. I don't know why all these cards came out. I wanted an outcome card. I didn't want all of this. Well, but this is energy from other signs. I already know this because this has happened in all the other signs. All right, so we have the Ace of Wands, we have the Two of Pentacles, we have the Four of Cups, and then we have the, this Four of Cups, Ace of Wands, Four of Cups, Two of Pentacles, and the Five of Cups. This has come out in Taurus and in Aries reading, and it was also in quite a bit of the general reading. Gemini. There is... A lot happening around you and there is an opportunity that you too can experience these things that you too can be pulled into this energy that everyone else is going through and what I would say is if this is something you're interested in new opportunities reflection but having still new ways of viewing things new cups available to you making decisions about possibly taking some trips, making some big changes, and then having to spend some time feeling maybe not so great about it, then, you know, move forward, go forth, prosper. If you want to go on a different journey, because I do believe that that's what this entire reading is about, is that for you, there is the opportunity for a difference, for a change. I would say... Be mindful. Be aware. Look and see what others are doing while you're also taking account of what's going on with you. And then if you're like, well, that sounds like a mess. Don't get involved. Go the different direction. 
fact, possibility is completely and totally available to you. So that's it, Gemini. That's your summer reading. Do your thing. Shine. It's a beautiful reading. And let me know what your plans are for the summer. What you think of the reading. What you'd like to come forth. What plans you're trying to make. The changes that are available and already happening to you. And the ones that you'd like to have. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to see more. And I'm going to move and do some more reading. So I hope you have a great time. Happy summer solstice. I'll see you later. Bye.